everyone, what's up and welcome back to my channel. I hope you guys are doing awesome. I'm sure you saw the title of this video and you're like, hell yes, Mal, we were waiting for this. Um, very recently, I uploaded a video when I spoke about my favorite lipsticks and they all happen to be high end. So what I did is I went into all my drawers and I pulled out, I think should be around 12 to 13, I'm not sure favorite drugstore lipsticks okay so this doesn't necessarily have to be color but you know my color choices right mauve nude coral these are my choices um and i happen to do red as well in this video but i picked these drugstore lipsticks on the basis of formulation and how i think of lipsticks to be like these qualify as really good quality drugstore lipsticks now some of them might be slightly expensive like 800 bucks but most of them are like 500 600 rupees so these according to me are the best drugstore lipsticks at the moment and of course there are so many i haven't tried out there i'm very sure but whatever i had in my capacity and in my vanity i have picked out personally and i swatched it and trust me you guys when i swatch it i'm like why haven't i used this lipstick it is so good so gear up sit back relax and enjoy because i swatch for you my favorite drugstore lipsticks at the moment so let's go all right so the first lipstick i'm gonna swatch for you is the nika so creme lipstick in the shade let it snooze um i chose this lipstick simply because it is inexpensive the color payoff is really good and the finish of this is cream right but it's not so creamy uh, that it spills all over <laughs> it stays intact and it's the right amount of creaminess that i would um, expect a cream lipstick to have so i thought i would keep this because not everybody loves a matte finish so i think this is a great way to go uh, if you're looking for that beautiful pigmentation along with shade range that is inexpensive so yeah then the next lipstick we have is the nika ultra matte lipstick in the shade audrey but they have some amazing shades here and i was obsessed with this lipstick back in the day when it launched and i was only using this lipstick it is so good and i forgot how awesome it is so one swipe and you get a complete pigment and it is so matte you guys like this is a proper ultra ultra matte lipstick um very comfortable to wear and if you're afraid of liquid lipsticks this is the way to go because literally dude i'm in love i don't know why i stopped using it but no it's really great so there is like a slight transfer and to be honest uh longevity of the lipstick doesn't bother me i can reapply it man it's just it's not a hard stop for me when i choose my lipsticks Then we have the Color Bar Sinful Matte Lip Color in the shade Do Me Darling. And um, also beautiful, beautiful color payoff. Very, very soft on the lip. Um, it's a soft matte formulation, so it does transfer. But again, that is not a problem for me. And I chose this because they have a good shade range. It's good quality. And the component of the lipstick is so heavy and luxurious feeling that it would be a great gift to anybody that you love so um that's why i chose this specifically and i like color bar as a brand i feel like they do really good products and good quality then we have the nyx soft matte lip cream in sao paulo and again the shade range on this is extensive the color payoff is beautiful like you can see and it just feels good it's a staple matte lipstick i feel like all of us own one of these nyx <laughs> Uh, lip creams but yeah i don't have any complaints with this it is a matte formula and it's beautiful the next lipstick is the nyx suede lipstick in la la land and look at how cute the component is firstly such a good idea to gift this to someone um, again the color payoff like you can see is so nice and this shade in specific la la land is one of my favorite shades it's not a nude of course but it's got that brick brown beautiful tone to it and again it's a soft matte finish so it will definitely transfer it's got this suede finish clearly what the bottle says uh, but yeah you can choose your color in this but i personally like this shade you guys so i mean it's true to its color but look how beautiful i love it i love all the lipsticks in this dude <laughs> Okay, we have one more NYX lipstick. Hello, it's the Powder Puff Lippy Cream in Puppy Love. And this is a tube form. Um, it's got a spongy applicator. So you press the liquid lip and it comes up from the other end. This is in no way, shape or form a matte lipstick. I mean, it'll transfer. 
but look at how like the color payoff is so good like you would imagine a lipstick like this to be very liquidy but it is bang on it's so nice so comfortable and such a cute component as well so perfect for like putting it into those little hampers it look really really cute the next lipstick I'm going to mention is the Maybelline Superstay Crayon Lipstick in Enjoy the View. This lipstick has to be my favorite pick amongst all the others today simply because the formulation on this lipstick is so bang on. If you don't like the um, liquid lipstick feel on your lips, go for this because this is a crayon okay and it's not messy. It applies so beautifully. It goes on cream and it dries down matte. And the color payoff again is gorgeous. This was so good. I don't know why I haven't explored this more. Um, so yeah, I highly, highly recommend this. It's so comfortable to wear. And the best part is A, it doesn't transfer. And B, it's got a tiny sharpener that you can um, sharpen that little nib with. The next lipstick is the L'Oreal Paris Rouge Signature Matte Lipstick in 116 I Explore. It's such a fancy name. Uh, but yeah, this is extremely, extremely lightweight. It's very, very thin. You have to build it up by adding at least five to six layers to see its true pigmentation. But I chose this because um, it's very, very comfortable and you cannot tell that you're wearing a lipstick when you do wear this. Uh, you can also apply this on your cheek as a blush. So it's basically like a tint, I believe. Yep. Then we have the Maybelline Stay Matte Ink Liquid Lipstick in the shade Versatile. This is again such a good liquid lip. But baby, this is slightly tricky because this lipstick you will feel on your lips. It's one of those um, sticky formulations, but it is so hard to remove, you guys. Like you will need an oil-based cleanser and a wipe to take this lipstick off because it is like ink baby once it's on it's on and it will not come off so yeah if you're looking for longevity i think this lipstick would be your favorite but trust me you can feel it on your lips it's got this um look like the sticky feeling but i don't have a problem i'm a like i said sucker for matte lipsticks but this shade in particular is my favorite and the shade called lover from this range is my favorite one then we have this guy's cosmetics liquid lip cream in the shade excited coral but this is in no way coral honey it is like pink when i say pink pink <laughs> it's such a hot pink color and oh my god like i love how it looks through the screen and it looks like this in person as well okay so yeah it is loud it is poppy it is fun and they have other colors as well which you can check out this lipstick however is drying on your lip okay it does not transfer hence it is drying so you will definitely have to put a lip balm or something underneath to make sure that it's not cracking up on your lip but i chose this because i mean look at the color payoff hello that is really brilliant then we have one more nyx lipstick this is the makeup line and load in the shade biker babe this is such a such an interesting formula and the nib is so pencil like so you can line your lips with it as well but this is again a mind-blowing formulation it is so velvety and this is a matte matte lipstick okay like it will not come off but um it is so good that's all i can say they have some i think they have like nudie brown shades as well but if you're looking for a red man like this is it look at the color screaming through the screen and the formulation ultra comfortable it is so comfortable like i was beyond shocked when i put it i'm just like wow then we have the Flower Beauty uh, Miracle Matte Liquid Lip in Soft Berry. Another very interesting formula. Literally, when you put this on, it feels like you're applying water on your lips. It's got this weird formulation, but it's not uncomfortable. Like, the more you apply, the more it gives you that water feeling. I can't explain. <laughs> but again, it lasts a really long time. It is a liquid lipstick and it is slightly more expensive than all the other lipsticks. Like 800 bucks, I think. But uh, it has a beautiful color range. And this color in specific is my favorite. And it is really long lasting and lovely. So yeah, thank you so much. Anyway, thank you so much for watching. Those are my picks for drugstore lipsticks. Thank you so much for requesting this video because I also discovered a lot of lipsticks that I should have long time ago. So thank you. I love you guys so much. Thank you for supporting me through and through. And all the links to these lipsticks will be down below.
Mwah. I love you so much.